Last video, we said this was the last day in Kota Kinabalu. Actually, the cheapest flight is tomorrow, so we're heading out tomorrow to Sandakan. Today, we're headed to City Mosque. Our grab tax is here, so we're gonna go. Thank you. We're going to the City Mosque. It's our first time going to any mosque ever, so we don't really know what to expect. But it'll be cool to see a different culture and kind of uh, what their tradition is here. And today, I did not go downstairs to get the coffee. I only got water and he is very upset with me. Who That's doesn't get coffee? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I can't, my throat hurts really bad and Anna says it's because I bite my nails. So I don't know, it's a rough day. I said he's gonna get, if he gets sick, it's because he puts his fingers in his mouth and they're germs. Came a little early, it's 8 a.m. open. This place is beautiful. The mosque is right on the water. Look at it, it's, looks like it's floating on this water right here. Now we're gonna put on traditional clothing. They're gonna clothe us. Anna's currently in the dressing room. They're so nice here. Anna. That one's pretty. I think I'm looking good. Okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, do I look good? Wow. It seems like we're the only ones here and we're gonna have some great tour guides back here. They've been very awesome for us and they're gonna teach us a little about the religion. Anna! You're really looking good. I like that color on you, huh? Anna! Hey, let me get you. How do I look? My man had me over here. Look at this. I look good. What are your guys' names? Jaja. Jaja? Yes. And then what's your name? Alina. Alina and Jaja. Yeah, yeah. Anna's getting an umbrella. There we go. <laughs> take off the shoes. Should I take off my socks? Uh, okay. You are the first customer of the day. Oh, we're the first? <laughs> yes. Wow. That's it's... why you see it's empty. Oh my gosh. I feel so special. <laughs> yeah, you're special. <laughs> Oh, oh, the how many? oh, oh, okay. Um, I would say no, a thousand. A thousand. A thousand. It's twelve thousand. Twelve thousand wow. people yes, sitting here. Yes, it's twelve thousand. Last uh, celebration for Muslim, which is Eid Mubarak, we make a new record, which is twenty-five thousand. Twenty-five thousand in here. Yeah, in here and also outside. How do they do? They just scrunch together. They have like a carpet, and then they just line up together and pray. Okay. Yeah. So what's the difference? So Arabic Muslim, mm -hmm. actually it's the same. It's the same, the same. but it's, the difference is just because we are following the Quran. So every Muslim around the world, we're following the Quran. But the difference is just how they how they understand the Quran and how they adapt using the Quran. Okay. Some people misunderstanding, some people use it that way, right way, and everything. Yeah. Actually, it's the same. Just, just like same. anything, yeah. Who's the Quran? No, the Quran is the, the Bible. Ah, the Quran uh, is the Holy Book. You yeah. Have okay. Seen one. Ah, okay, I show you come because Islam teaches peace, peace inside our hearts. Ah, oh, I like uh -huh. that. Why do uh, we have to cover up like this? Is that what? yeah? Why do um, why do like women have to cover up all the way? Ah, uh, because it is inside the Quran say that we need to cover. Okay, but, so it's in the uh, Bible. For niqab, niqab, it's just a culture. Oh, okay, where they cover uh, their whole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But for those who wants to use it, is it okay? For those who doesn't want to use it. No so it's optional. Yeah. Do you it's, have to do this every day, no matter what, or is it like at what age do you start wearing? Um, starting from the moment you get old period. Oh, okay. Yeah. When they what? Anna? Get their period. Yeah. Okay. Sometimes if the if the kids they want to wear in the young age, it's also okay. okay. It depends on the parent. So this is the Quran. Ooh. Is this your first time? Yeah, this yeah. is the first time I've ever okay. seen it. But this one is um, not the fully Arabic one because this one has uh, English translation. So it's good because you can see it. Okay. Oh. When we pray, we read the Arabic. Yeah, gotcha. that makes sense. So you can read in Arabic. 
Arabic too. Yes. And then you know Malaysian and English. Yes. But then Arabic, um, basically for me, I know how to read, but I can't communicate in Arabic. Okay. Yes. So you pray five times a day, and it's called to call to prayer, right? Yeah, it's okay. called to prayer. It's the time when people can come to the mosque and pray. And can and you do it like at home? Yeah, sure. Anywhere? Yeah. yeah. So when you're on Friday um, service, do you pray together or men and women are still separate? Yeah, still separate. So you, you have to separate from like your husband? And... Yes. Okay. Okay. That is the biggest fan we've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's actually having a wedding over here today, but they don't close it. They let tourists see how, it, how they do it. So it's very cool. I learned a lot because Ian already knew a bunch of stuff. I didn't even know how to spell Allah. But How'd you spell it? A L A, like Aladdin. Allah, <laughs> I don't know. We learned that men and women pray separately in the mosque. There's a schedule for their prayer, their daily prayers, and it's when they are called to pray, it's five times a day, and it's actually called called to pray. And there's a word for it in Arabic, but I don't remember what it was. I learned a lot with Anna. Trust me, I didn't know a lot of this stuff. Um, first of all, this is the biggest mosque in Borneo, which is the region we are in in Malaysia, which is very cool. Next thing I learned was that the Bible has a lot of the similarities. The Catholic Bible has a lot of similarities as the Quran, a lot of the same stories. The guides were really helpful, and we learned a lot here today. It's very nice. I like our outfits too. Yeah, it was awesome to learn about the Islam culture here in Kota Kinabalu. If you're here in the city, this is a definitely must-see place. So check it out if you're here. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and comment down below what you think. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram. See you in the next one. Bye.